Hey guys, it's Mush, and I'd like to thank you all for 500 subscribers. So to celebrate, I asked you all some questions in a video three months ago, Ray, to do a Q&A. Here's the video. I'd like to thank you all for the questions you asked. You guys almost asked 50 questions, which is insane. I was not expecting this many questions at this point in subscribers. Seeing as this is a Q&A video, I'm going to go and ask you guys a question. What made you subscribe to this channel? Tell me in the comments. Anyways, let's get started. Kendall, or well, well, Nightmare, because I, I know who you are, asks, Do you think Nintendo will ever nerf the Clash Blaster? Well, I mean, there, there, there are ups and downs to nerfing the Clash Blaster, but, it, but I don't think they will. I don't think they'll buff it, but nerfing it is a, a, a whole new thing. So, I'm gonna say no. Mega asks, what are your thoughts on Pokemon Let's Go, Eevee, and Pikachu? I think it's pretty cool, but I'm more excited about the actual RPG game in whatever it's in uh, what, next year, 2019. Same thing. <laughs> but I think it's pretty cool with the motion controls and the Pokeball Plus thing. Yet, <laughs> Shaw asks, what got you to join the Splatoon community? Well, maybe the, the people, the YouTubers, fellow, fellow uh, YouTubers, j just so nice, as opposed to like other communities. And I wanted to do um, Splatoon videos for a while probably since the game launched and I never had to do that gotten to do that so here we are <laughs> dry guy asks if ink if an inkling was on fire how would you put it out because water kills it well guys use a fire blanket I'll put a picture on the screen I don't know if it's anywhere else in the world but in Australia we definitely have fire blankets um <laughs> yeah you see the fire blank, you put it over. It might not be big enough, but still, use it. Naisu Galaxy asks, Will you change your icon to be an Octoling? Um, no. I'm, you're probably, you're probably saying that because of what I, what, because I was an Octoling in that video. Um, I have no plans of changing my actual, um, original character, or OC, to an Octoling. So, I won't be changing it, my icon to an Octoling. My OC will still be my Inkling. It's just, I like playing as both. The Bread asks, how much hacks do you use when you're playing Splatoon 2? Let me just check. Hang on, I don't use any hacks. Bread, Bread, are you accusing me? <laughs> so, to your answer, negative of 2 million percent. Because that's totally a percent. Shroomy Shoe asks, What do you think the best dualies are and why? I think the best dualies are the unvary Splat dualies. The, they have the best sub in the game, the Curling Bombs. And... They're just... Great. And the Inkjet is quite um, meta. If you get what I'm saying. Lucas asks, if you could choose any Splatfest theme you wanted, tournaments included, what theme would you choose? It would be cool to have a Splatoon 1, Splatoon 2, or maybe a Nintendo character like Mario, Peach, or franchise, you could say. Because tournaments, it could be like, um, Super Mario, it's like Mario, even just characters, Mario, Luigi... Peach, Daisy, I don't know. Something like that. Teabag703 asks, What was your favourite Splatfest theme? Um, definitely the comedy and action one, as it was my first actual win since the game launched. Phoenix19 asks, If you could add a new weapon, anything you want, even something never seen before, what would it be and what sub and special would it have? I would probably... um. 
uh, say, like a splatter scope that you can still shoot from in scope. Because currently you can only do one shot with um, this splatter scope. I think that would be quite cool. But of course there will be a cooldown, like, let's say, a few seconds. A second cooldown. A few milliseconds. Who knows. But it would have, like, a, a burst bomb and a splashdown special. So... Pretty much everything's quick, except except for the splatter scope. <laughs> Miles FM asks, the below statement is true, the above statement is false. Can you answer this paradox? Maybe, Miles? I don't know. That's all I'm saying. I'm kidding, Miles. I can. Because the below statement is true, the above statement is false, therefore the below, sta the below statement is not true. Because that makes sense. Gold Train Rider asks, who would you choose for a Pearl Marina Splatfest? Probably Marina, as I relate more to her. Because I've been on her team, like, besides two Splatfests. Which is the Sci-Fi one and uh, the Squid and Octoling one. Small Ice Cream asks, if you could play as Off the Hook or Squid Sisters, who would it be? Uh, it would probably be off the hook, seeing as I haven't played Splatoon 1. Astron AI asks, What is your favourite weapon in Splatoon 2? My favourite weapon is the un uh, the Unperry Splat Dooleys, as I said before with my favourite dually. Hoenn007 asks, When Splatoon 2 was released, what specials did you want to make a return on the game? Well, seeing as I haven't played Splatoon 1, nor had it have had a Wii U. I would say the specials are kind of OP. Just me being me. Me not having played a Splatoon 1. So I would say none. Kendon the person asked, what is your favourite meme so far this year? No you. Why me? No you. Zcool9z asks, what are future plans for YouTube? Just keep doing what I'm doing, upload what I like. That's pretty much what I have in mind. Barry De B Man asks, What's your favourite game besides Splatoon or Splatoon 2? Um, I would have to say Fortnite, considering I don't really play any other games. <laughs> which is sad. Cat Rose asks, When did you find your love for Splatoon? Probably at the Nintendo Switch Direct in January 2017. I think it was probably a little earlier than that, but I'm not 100% sure. PK Love asks, if you had the opportunity to collab with any YouTuber slash tuber, who would it be? Well, I'm open to anyone well known in the Splatoon community, I guess. Not necessarily people like Vin, Fishy, Gigi, and Octoboy, but if there was a big collab, then heck yeah, I'd enjoy it. <laughs> MK Pell asks, was the Splatfist map good? And he's talking about the Pulp vs. No Pulp Splatfist map. I, I think it's pretty good. I'm quite bland <laughs> when I say that, but I, I kind of have no opinion. I like the glass in the middle. Uh, you probably saw in my Splat, that Splatfist video, we had a party. Songbird asks, what inspired you to start a YouTube channel? I started I started my YouTube channel because probably Vane's music montages if it wasn't for Vane uh Vane's music montages and the switch um recording feature um I probably would not be here today talking to you guys and things doing having 500 subscribers doing this Q&A it's insane really Hoppy Carter asked how I reached my goal of 500 People subscribed to me. How, how, how else would have I achieved my goal? Vasco asks, "What's the weirdest thing you've eaten?" These are like these. Um, we go, go to this chocolate factory sometimes, and we get these. Uh, once I was younger than I am today. Um, I think it's like passion fruit, and me not being used to alcohol. Um. I had, I had one, and 
did not like it. Did not like the taste, did not like the aftertaste. I just hate it. <laughs> That's probably as weird as it sounds, but I'm pretty bland when it comes to eating. Gabrielle Miller asks, which weapon do you believe deserves a buff? People are saying the e liter needs a buff, but considering that I don't really care about <laughs> buffs and things, but I'm just curious about it, maybe... I'm going to say the e liter on the basis that pe people want the e liter buffed. I think it's because of its range. Seth Herndon is asked, what do you want to see Nintendo bring to either the Switch or into Splatoon 2? More weapons, more maps into Splatoon 2, because we're only going to get updates until December. Fredbear asks, How did you meet Yes Joe? Uh, it was through Vasco's, um, one of Vasco's Discord servers. Uh, I think we were talking, I think we were on the same team for the comedy and action splat first. So I decided, so we were just playing together and we just started talking and things. That's pretty much how we met. I'm sure Joe will um, clarify and add to it. I don't know. Unless he can't remember, then I don't blame him. It was quite in January, so a few, uh, quite a few months ago. Dakota asks, can you make 2v2 videos? Probably, but they'll probably be the same as like my 1v1 videos, which isn't really a series. And I'm not doing it with fans, as you probably know. But, yeah. Octogab asks, Would you like the Splatoon world to be real? Being o Octoling or Inkling? Just think of what would happen. You, you could get, quote-unquote, splattered. I'm going to say Pearl and Marina, who's presenting you the battle stages and the news. <laughs> I, th I personally think it would be cool, but I don't think it should be real. Clush B Lizzie asks, what my favorite color is um orange if you couldn't tell yet yeah, yeah just in case you couldn't tell eric ah asks can i have your accent what's with you guys wanting to steal my accent what happens with my accent do i get like an american accent because it, it's not going to go well <laughs> I, i'm happy with my accent so eric it's 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 a kind no Yes, Joe asks, what game did you play most before Splatoon? Probably Minecraft, I'll say. I was playing a lot of it with friends. So, probably that. Hannah Nicole asks, why did you start YouTube? Probably just something to do. Like, when I was, I enjoy making videos now. So, we'll, we'll see what happens in the future. Veen asks, what single most thing do you want to happen before reaching 1k subs? Do a lot of collabs. Because, I mean, doing collabs with um, YouTubers higher than me is, would be quite cool. And also helping those um, YouTubers, Swatubers, um, with uh, lower subscribers than me. So, I think that would be quite um, good, helpful, meet new people in the community. Yeah. <laughs> Nitro Guy asks, did you watch Avengers Infinity War? Um, no, I have not. Alphastar716 asks, of all the videos you've made, which is your favourite? Probably my Clamblet music montage video. The whatever it takes word. I'll link it in the description or I'll put it as a card somewhere. I like all the things I mention in the description. But, yeah, probably that one. It didn't take me long to edit either. I was expecting it to take longer, but it didn't so I was quite happy when I finished it and I was happy with the end product as well. You the best around us. What's your favorite childhood memory? Can we be real? Embracing the fact that you are a child. Just embracing the fact that you are a child. Let's be real. I'm sure everyone's favorite childhood memory is that. Or if not at least somewhere on their top three. Vic Fallon asks what gear set that doesn't exist for your favorite weapon that you wish Nintendo would add? Seeing as I like the dualies, it would be cool to see either the bo new Booyah Bomb or maybe the Splashdown, because I've always wanted Splashdown on dualies, and we got that with the Dark Tetra dualies, which is cool. So either that, special, or maybe, maybe a, a, another Burst Bomb, another Curling Bomb, seeing as we've gotten that with the other 
dualies, uh, the duplicate subs and specials. So it would be cool to see. Or oh, Splat Bomb. I don't know. <laughs> One of those three subs. The best listen ass. What's your favorite type of weapon? Like the dualies umbrellas? Well, dualies. You, you, you t totally couldn't tell from the past questions. <laughs> Kayla asks If you could bring an old game back and have it released on Switch, what game would you choose? Let's say some uh, Pokemon from, let's say, Game Boy or DS or something like that. Katie asks Splatoon 1 or Splatoon 2? Splatoon 2 on the basis that I haven't played Splatoon 1. I've said that how many times now? <laughs> Evie asks, do you like Down Under by Minute Work? If you don't know what song I'm talking about, I'll, I'll uh, play it now. And yes, I do. <laughs> it, it's a good song. It's about Australia. And phew, that's it. I'm sorry if your question wasn't answered. Some of them were basically the same as another. Even though I said to ask different questions, you guys are very bad at looking. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.